Hey, welcome to the next lesson of our zigzag tutorial series. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to add a score mechanic to your game. So to get started, we want to add some game objects to our scene for displaying the player's score. So to get started, I'm going to expand our canvas game object, and I'm going to right click on our action button since we're using that as our main panel. I'm then going to go down to UI and select text. We can then rename this object to something like score. And I'm going to change the anchor points to be in the top right corner. I'm then going to reposition and resize this object so that it is in the top right corner of our screen. We can then change the text field so that it is just zero. And I'm going to set the alignment so that it is aligned to the right and center. I'm then going to select best fit and set the max size to something like 100. Next, let's duplicate this object by hitting Ctrl D and we're going to drag it onto our game over panel. We can then re-enable our game over panel and I'm going to position this text object right underneath our game over title. I'm then going to center the alignment and we can then disable our game over panel. From here, we can now start programming our score mechanic and so I'm going to open up our menu controller script. In here we need to add some new variables. The first one is going to be an int called myScore. And I'm going to set it equal to negative 1. We then need a serialized field of type text. And since we haven't added the UI namespace, we can select text and then hold alt, press enter, and then select add the using unityengine.ui namespace. I'm then going to call this variable score display one and then we'll need another serialized text variable and this one's going to be called score display two. So now we need to create a new function that will add a point to our my score variable and then update the score display text objects. So I'm going to scroll down to the bottom and I'm going to type void add score then inside this function, we're going to type my score plus plus, and then score display one dot text equals my score dot two string. We then need to do the same thing for our score display two dot text equals my score dot two string. And then all we have to do is call this function, and I'm going to call it within our turn button function. This will make it so that every time our player switches directions, they will add one point to their score. So now let's save this script, and we'll go back to Unity. Inside Unity, we need to select our canvas game object because that's what has our menu controller script. We then need to just drag our two text game objects that we just created into our score display one and then the other one into our score display two. So now we can go ahead and play our game and see how it works. So I'm going to start rolling and now every time I change directions you can see that our score is incremented by one. Then when I roll off of our path our game over panel appears and you can see that our second score display shows the same score. So that's everything that I'm going to cover in this lesson on how to add a score mechanic to your zigzag game. 